you want to support me, smash that like button and go and buy my book on Instagram at Nene Marie 37 man. Yo, it's your boy Church of News and I'm back at y'all with another one. Appreciate all the support. Thanks for everyone who subscribed to the channel. If you ain't subscribed to the channel, make sure you do. Make sure you join the membership. Shout out to the Real Mod Squad. If you ain't following my mods, make sure you follow late ads at the end of this video. Remember, if you got anything extra, man, that you can give away. Food, hygiene, clothes, uh, whatever you can give, man. Back it up. Take it outside. Remember, we all one step away from being homeless. I don't care how much money you say you got, man. You could lose it all overnight, and then you be outside, man. So remember to give, man. It's good giving, man. Um... I got two topics. To, I got two topics before I go live, man. I want to say, let's say the kids, man. That's what we should be working at. It don't matter about whatever else somebody time about, bro. Let's say the kids, bro. The kids are dying. Whether you got kids or if you don't got kids, you still supposed to want the kids to stay alive. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's my message, man. All that other BS, bro, mix me with it, bro. I don't care what y'all time about. Because ain't nobody ever played with me in the streets, man. Since I when I was in the street, so you know I'm 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 gonna go with the W on this one. I'm doing it for the kids and the adults and the women and a and a man who civilians. Hey, but anyways, man, I got Tay Savage, man. I got Tay Savage. I'm gonna re break down for you know the slow pokes and everything about the jail thing. But I want to get into this um Lil Mo M O B um Lil Mo M O B scrap six block or whatever y'all call Lil Mo, man. I seen a video today, man, a arrest video. Shout out to Chirac Humor. Chirac Humor, man, that was one of the real, that was the realest video that you had. And people might say, Trenches News, what you mean about a jail video and people getting handcuffed real? Man, that was the realest video. I'm going to explain. Smash that like button, man. I need this video to go up and get around, man, in this algorithm. I need y'all to share all my videos to Reddit if you got it. You know what I'm saying? Smash that like button. All right, so it was a video that um, the rest of a lot of grown MOB members, and they was outside with Lil Mo. Now, we talk about this type of situation every day, man. And for Chirac Human to upload it and not seeing it, I'm like, damn, I got to report about this. So Lil Mo and them, they was outside, you know, the gang members shooting dice and all that. You know how you be on the block. So some D-Techs, somebody called the detectives and told them, that you know a minor was outside with with some with some gang members you know how that go or the police just rolled past and hopped on the scene that this little boy be with them every day and enough is enough so they had ran up on them it was like seven or eight of them on the wall you know against the wall and there was one dude he was just yappity yappity yap and i know little mo little mo you know i know shout out to little mo man you know what i'm talking about with his career and everything he accomplished before a lot of people who've been rapping. Shout out to Lil Mo. I ain't got nothing but respect for him. Scrap, I ain't got nothing but respect for him. Big less and all of them. But the truth is the truth, man. And a lot of kids being misled like that, bro. You know what I'm saying? And I'm glad the police has spoke up. It made me feel good to hear the police saying that you knowing that a police care. You know what I'm talking about? To even say that y'all going to jail. Dude say, what we going to jail for? He saying, um, delinquency of a minor. He say, man, I, I don't control this. I, I don't supposed to control this. He said, he said, shit, I got the remote now. I finna control it. You know what I'm talking about? Y'all going to jail. And took uh, took all of them to jail, bro, for having for having a little boy around, bro. Like, the, the, what I'm telling y'all is, it's a difference between you out on the block and then Lil Mo crowd and they crowd. No, not Lil Mo being in your crowd. Uh, none of that. No, this should never happen, bro. But it did happen. And he and shorty, what you call all tens, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, I hear motherfuckers saying they scared of him before they saying they scared of anybody from over there. And I'm just keeping it real. But I was glad to see that. If y'all want to see that video, man, the arrest video, go over there to Chirac Humor and check it out, man. That's a that, that was one of the videos that made me think, um, like, it is some police out here that's good. That care, bro, because you wouldn't want nobody with your kid. Just look at it at the end of the day if you try to argue with me. Just look at it at the end of the day. If it was your kid, 10, 11 year old outside, every day holding guns and shit, the hand that he's shooting and everything. You hear me? Like, come on, man. But I want to get back into this Tay Savage thing. Tay Savage had got arrested. 
um, on a parole violation for um, traveling out of state. He was a got an absconder from absconder means um, AWOL from um, Vienna Correctional Facility. Now, I can tell you this. Tay ain't finna do no long time. Tay already did. Tay already um, did his time. He was um, up for parole. Um, he shouldn't have that much parole time left. He been out for almost two years since he been home. So he came home 22 of March and it's 24 of March. So he been out for two years. They gon they gon and it's at 85. It's probably three years at 85 because it was aggravated his case. So what that is, is take three years off 85 at 85%, three years at 85%. And when you take that off, which is three years at eighty five percent, that should be like two years and six months, some shit like that. And then you chop that in half with the time that he already got. The most he gonna do is a couple of months. They might just um let him out. They might just let him out um after you go and see the parole board in Stateville. He gonna go and see the parole board, and um they let him out. And like they, I've been seeing people get let out. Not too many people make it, bro. You don't see a lot of people, them just letting people out. But for A walls and shit like that, and you ain't caught no new case or none of that, you just failure to report. You just come up with an excuse for them and they'll they'll let you back out into the world. You know what I'm saying? But if you got if you got other cases and shit like that, they ain't they gonna violate you. Or you can beat the like I beat the parole board. I beat the parole board for a case that I caught. I went to the parole board, I had a case. Um, a delivery case. They were trying to say I served the police and shit. So, you know, I took the case for a motherfucker, though. I took the case because I was going back on the parole. I was just around them. So I took the case, went to Stateville, told them, man, I ain't never had sold no drugs in my life. Y'all can look on my background. The lady looked on my background, seen that I ain't had no drugs, and reinstated me, a black lady. I went back to the county, bonded out on these, these real facts. So Tay ain't going to do a lot of time, man. The most he'll do is a, a few months, man. He'll be right back out, man. I hope he get out with the same attitude and, you know, to go up even more, man. Just trying snooze, man. Tay kids, they minds, they nine, man. They can be whatever they want to be in life, man. Let's just get them. We just got to get them a chance, man, all of us. Um, Like I said, shout out to Lil Mo that wasn't no bash and none of that. It was just cool seeing that it's people who can in the community that, that's supposed to be serving and protect. I could say this because I pay taxes. I pay a lot of taxes, as a matter of fact. And by me paying taxes, I'm paying for people to go to jail. I'm paying for you to stay in there. I'm paying for all that shit. So I, why, why, why is my money going to aid in the bed and, and helping y'all um, stay in there? I might as well speak up about it. This trench news, man. I'm going live in a minute.